people see bananas like this and they see trash. I see bananas like this and I see banana bread. But I'm a cookie girl. So how can a cookie girl enjoy banana bread with the little tasty treat fusion? And I'm going to show you exactly how I do it. Coming up next. from scratch easy. Today I'm really excited to share with you my chocolate chip cookie banana bread fusion treat. Mmm. Now this banana bread is jam-packed not only with chocolate chip cookie dough but chocolate chips as well. You're gonna love it and I'm gonna show you the ingredients that you will need right now. Butter, granulated sugar, light brown sugar, eggs, vanilla extract, baking soda, cinnamon, kosher salt, three overripe bananas, all-purpose flour, melt chocolate chips, and chocolate chip cookie dough. To mix up my ingredients, I'll be using a large bowl, a whisk, and a spatula. I also will be using my KitchenAid stand mixer fixed with my paddle attachment. My oven, I'm going to preset that to 350 degrees. I'm going to start by adding the butter to my bowl. And let's mix it up. Now I'm gonna add my granulated sugar to my bowl. Next, I'm gonna add my light brown sugar. And let's mix it up. For a little flavor, I will be adding vanilla extract. Time to mix it up. Now to my eggs. I always crack my eggs into a separate bowl because if the shell falls in or it's a bad egg, it falls in my separate bowl, not my batter. I'm gonna go ahead and add that egg in now and then I'm gonna go ahead and mix it up. Now taking my spatula, I want to go ahead and scrape down the sides of the bowl. I want to make sure that all of my wet ingredients is thoroughly mixed together. And I'm not going to forget the bottom. Let's mix it up. Now it's time for the dry ingredients. I'm going to add to my flour salt, cinnamon, and baking soda. Taking my whisk, I'm going to go ahead and mix it up. Banana bread is a quick bread, meaning you don't have to worry about dough to rise. But please be careful because if you overwork your dough, you will have tough bread. So the rest of this mixing it up will be done by hand. Taking my flour, I'm going to go ahead and add it in to my wet ingredients. Taking my spatula, I'm going to fold in my dry ingredients into the wet. Now for the star ingredient, the bananas. I'm going to go ahead and fold them in now. Now I'm going to add my chocolate chips. One tip to use in order for your chocolate chips not to settle to the bottom is to take a little bit of flour and coat your chocolate chips. And now I'm ready to add them in 
now. Using my Pam spray, I'm gonna go ahead and spray my pan. Now, my Pam baking spray is made with flour and oil. Now that my pan is all sprayed, I'm ready to place my banana bread dough and my chocolate chip cookie dough into my pan. I'm gonna alternate the two and then I'm gonna to top it with some chocolate chips. Let me show you how I do it. my banana bread in the oven for one hour. Now that my bread is out of the oven, I'm going to let it cool down for 10 minutes before I remove it from my pan. Now that my chocolate chip cookie dough banana bread has cooled down, I'm now ready to take it out of the pan. Using my spatula, I'm gonna go ahead and go around the edge of my pan. Now flipping my pan over, I'm gonna go ahead and release my banana bread out. Now using my serrated knife, I'm gonna go ahead and slice my banana bread up. And now it's time to taste our tasty treat. Ready, Do? Here we go. I see the cookie dough. Mighty, mighty, delicious. Mm. Mm. This is very good. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> I see you in the next one. And subscribe for more.